Welcome to the College Investor Audio Show, where we talk about the biggest issues impacting millennial money, from student loan debt to side hustles to building wealth. We will show you how to get out of debt so that you can build real wealth for the future. This is the College Investor Audio Show. If this is your first time joining us, thank you and welcome. Today we'll talk about 10 flexible part time jobs you can do from anywhere. Now, in an ideal world, you'd be able to work full time, have a full class load, maintain some sort of personal, social life, and balance it all perfectly. Unfortunately, we don't live in an ideal world. Having a job while attending college is one of the keys to avoiding monstrous piles of student loan debt, but it can be hard to find a job that allows the flexibility you need. This is where an online job can come in handy. There are hundreds of perfectly legit ways to earn a part-time income on your own hours from the comfort of your home or dorm room. These 10 flexible part-time jobs are a great fit for college students. Let's dig right in. Search Engine Evaluator Big search engines like Google and Yahoo and Bing Hire evaluators to make sure that the search results listed for specific search terms are relevant. These jobs generally pay 10 to 15 per hour and are very flexible. To be considered for a search engine evaluator job, you'll need excellent research and communication skills. Here are some places you can apply for this work. There's one called Leap Force and also Appen, A-P-P-E-N, Appen. You can also be a freelance writer. So freelance writing is how... I started my work from home journey. It is one skill that is in huge demand. As more and more companies build their presence online, the need for competent writers has grown as well. The pay of a freelance writer can <laughs> vary greatly. At the low end, you can expect to get 20 bucks per article. At the higher end, 500 or more. Now, the pay you earn depends upon your areas of expertise, your writing abilities, of course, and how well you're able to market your services. The beauty of freelance writing is that while you'll have deadlines to meet, you won't have a set schedule. You can also scale up or down on work as your co commitments fluctuate. Social Media Manager Another higher paying freelance job is a social media manager. The median pay rate is 14 bucks an hour. However, if you're effective at your job, you can certainly earn a much higher hourly rate. You can look for social media positions at sites like Upwork.com, and monster.com, or you can pitch to local businesses. They're always looking for somebody. Transcriptionist. So a transcriptionist listens to audio and transcribes that content into text documents. There are a number of different transcriptionist opportunities. Medical transcription, transcribing podcasts, transcribing speeches, and a lot more. There are also many scams when it comes to transcription, so you need to be wary when looking for these types of jobs. General rule of thumb is to never pay to get a job. The average pay for transcription sits right around 15 bucks an hour. Hey, not bad. However, the pay will depend upon your speed and accuracy. Most companies will require you to pass a skills test if you're a new transcriber. Online tutor. Tutoring jobs have always been great options for college students, but can be cumbersome if you're working with a busy schedule. Now, Tutor.com will allow you to work as little as five hours per week or up to 29 hours a week. You're able to schedule sessions ahead of time according to your schedule, or you can pick up one of the available sessions at any time. There are a broad range of topics in need of new tutors. A website tester. Companies always want to make sure their websites are user-friendly and attractive. This is where website usability testers come in. So as a website tester, you review a website, normally a record a video of you using that website along with your audio commentary. If you have good communication skills, this could be a perfect fit for you. No set hours with this type of work. If you're interested in becoming a usability tester, you can sign up with a multiple, tons of different companies at thecollegeinvestor.com. Data Entry Specialists. So data entry jobs are not the highest paying online jobs by any means, but can be a good fit for beginners looking for some fairly simple work. As a data entry specialist, you take a set of data and organize it or put it in a specific program. You can expect anywhere from 6 to 12 bucks an hour for this type of work. 
Click Worker or Upwork, two great places to find some data entry jobs. Freelance Researcher. Okay, so if you ever had a question that you needed an answer for but didn't feel like researching it yourself, there are now freelance research sites dedicated to answering those questions. <laughs> no kidding. Ask Wonder is one site I'm familiar with that hires freelance researchers to answer their customers' questions. The pay varies depending on the complexity of the question being asked. The top researchers at Ask Wonder earn up to $35 an hour. Phew. ESL teacher. If you like teaching and are looking for a way to earn doing it, there are many places seeking ESL, which is English Second Language Teachers. These positions do require the ability to actually teach English to non-native English speakers. You generally do not need to know a second language. Start a blog. Let me be clear. Blogging is definitely not a get-rich-quick scheme or an easy way to earn money, despite what anyone tries to tell you. But if you have a little bit of spare time, Starting a blog and working on it can pay off over time, like in a year or two. While this particular job isn't going to earn you immediate income, it could definitely pay off down the road if you're willing to put in the effort. Finding a flexible part-time job that fits you. There's an abundance of flexible part-time jobs online, but it might take a little trial and error to find the one that best suits your skills, schedule, and pay requirements. As you're looking for jobs, be wary of scams. Eek. Never pay to get a job unless you're purchasing required equipment. And when in doubt, check the company on the Better Business Bureau website. We also have a list of 100 other flexible jobs at thecollegeinvestor.com, along with a bunch of links to all of the different services that we mentioned here, too, so you can get set up right away. And again, the website one more time, thecollegeinvestor.com. Thanks again for listening today. We hope you enjoyed it. We hope it was helpful to you and you can share it with a friend too. Maybe you can help somebody else out today. Find a cool, flexible part-time job online from the comfort of their home or dorm. Have an awesome day. We'll talk to you again soon.